Number 1. Lambert Museum. In the folds of the Emanuel Kant Park the Lambert Museum is devoted mostly to sculpture, and tracks the career of the Discord-based artist Wilhelm Lambert. The museum has 100 or so of his. Number 2. Landscapes Park Discord Noor. In the Mydrick district in the north of the city is a disused steelworks that has been turned into a public park. The facility shut down in 1985, and so in the early 90s, instead of demolish. Number 3. Inner Harbor. Anyone with an affinity for industrial architecture will want to spend some time in Discworks Inner Harbor, which was the lifeblood for the industrial city up to the 1960s. From the Industrial Revolution in 19. Number 4. Museum der Deutschen Binnenschifffahrt. In a lovely Art Nouveau public baths from the 1910s is a museum about the social and technical history of inland navigation. The museum is by the right bank of the Rhine, in the Ruhrort district, site. Number 5. Museum Kuppersmahal. The eye-catching building, rising seven stories over Discworks Inner Harbor is half the appeal of this contemporary art museum. The structure dates to 1908 and was a granary, installed with 42-meter steel grain silos. Number 6. Tiger and Turtle. A short way down the Rhine to the south of Discworks is an interactive art installation created in 2010 when the Ruhr was Europe's cultural capital. The Tiger and Turtle is basically a hilltop roller coaster with twisting. Number 7. Duisburg Rathaus. During the Industrial Revolution Duisburg's population exploded from 4,500 at the start of the 19th century to 100,000 at the end. The town hall had to be rebuilt twice during the century to cater to all its new citizens. Number 8. Mercaterbrunnen. The Flemish-German cartographer Gerardus Mercator lived the final 30 years of his life in Duisburg after leaving the city of Leuven because of his Lutheran sympathies. Mercator is famed for his 1569 world map, which used high. Number 9. Archaeologische Zone Alter Markt. When excavations were made for Duisburg Schiebahn at the start of the 1980s, the remains of the city's medieval market were uncovered on Bergplatz in front of the town hall. This had been the main market of school. Number 10. Duisburg Zoo. At the northern tip of the Duisburg urban forest, Duisburg Zoo is in 16 hectares, and is a habitat for almost 300 animal species. The attraction expanded in the post-war years around its water enclosures. The biggest of these. Hope you like this video. For more videos, please subscribe to our channel.